Welcome to Barnyard. No, not that one. Welcome to Barnyard. No, that's not Barnyard. Barnyard, Barnyard is a 2006 comedic animated film that dives into the secret lives of farm animals. It takes place on a traditional farm. What? No. No. Where the animals have adopted human-like behaviors and abilities, including walking upright and engaging in various activities, such as squirting on friends. Now that we've gotten that out of the way, I'm sure you've already taken a moment to Google for a free download of Barnyard, because I've already convinced you. <laughs> Haven't I? <laughs> How many can I put you down for? Come on, man, I need this. Barnyard holds a special place in my heart, evoking such a strong sense of nostalgia. As a child, my gaming experiences were limited to video game adaptions of movies, mainly because of my fascination of them, and this allowed my parents to enjoy some peace and quiet while I was engrossed in the captivating world on screen where male cows have udders. While it's certainly not biologically accurate for male cows to have udders, there's a section in the game that lets you explore different animation squirts. Yes, I really did just say that. So without further ado, let's remember Barnyard. So we're here, but should we have come? The main menu music, it's all coming back to me. Moving the mouse over the options. <laughs> it's like a didgeridoo. Do you want to be a boy or a girl? Where's the other? Come on now. Upon choosing my gender, I thought about choosing a skin, and honestly, I was stuck on these two. American with cheese. <laughs> Angus beef burger. <laughs> Straight away, I knew what name to pick, and I chose away, and then I realized that I was going to the slaughterhouse. <laughs> it has been 16 years since I've last seen this loading screen, and I briefly read the controls and already wanted to remap them. But I'll wait. You can't. I also turned off the music because, look, as nostalgic as it is, I'm not nine years old anymore, but oh damn. Welcome to the barnyard. The name's Ben. That's me! Or was. <laughs> Thanks. You should go ahead and meet the- Wait a second! There's no voice- There's no voice acting here! I guess you could say they had to- Make some budget cuts. We started our first mission, and honestly, it was just us picking up recipes. Apple pie recipes that we could just cook up. Oh, stroke of my dick, I got lotion on. And then have the pig literally eat it in front of us. Man's best friend or man's worst enemy. I remember as a kid hating Duke from spouting lies about the farmer to belittling me every time he'd beat me at pool. Getting better. Your dog meat! You hear me? Dog I was super passionate about playing this mini game as a kid. Honestly, I was a god at it. But it took me a while to get my senses going, and once I did, I was on an absolute roll. It's over, Anakin! I have the high ground! I finally got the star that I wanted. The star of David was finally mine, and it was time to celebrate. But I wasn't sure how to celebrate. A victory steak with a copy of Barnyard. Flip phones may be a sign of the past, but the joy of receiving messages on my phone remains ever <laughs> present. Welcome to Barnyard Dating, where every animal in Barnyard wants you. These animals will message you relentlessly and will not give up until you meet them in the Barnyard. Is it just me or does this game radiate sexual energy? <laughs> I'm glad bestiality is illegal. <laughs> do not do that. <laughs> AC-130 inbound. I believe it's fair to acknowledge that I may have negatively impacted your childhood memories of Barnyard with the creation of these terrible memes. It's about time for me to refocus my attention and begin squirting six of my animal friends. <laughs> okay. From this point forward, I assure you there will not be any more inappropriate jokes. <laughs> Let's talk about Barnyard's map. It's huge. It's kind of semi-open world where you can use your bike that you unlock to pretty much just go anywhere. And straight away, I was up to no good. Hey, hey. I remember doing this as a kid. <laughs> hey. You've run out of butter. <laughs> now I need to get butter. I need to get butter sticks. <laughs> oh, this is giving me flashbacks already. Ah, the art of making cream from milk and then churning it to make butter. Yes, that is exactly what you do in this video game. And honestly, it's for educational purposes. It's danger. What the hell is in there? <laughs> what? Why is there a danger box? Have I told you there is a day and night cycle in this game and that the farm animals come out? 
There's also this terribly out of place hill you need to climb in order to speak with a nighttime gopher trader from New Jersey. A new customer. Hey, I'm Joey. Take it easy. This underground gopher trader lets you upgrade your barn and purchase minigames with your spending money. Unavailable? What is it sold out? Christ, they even sell cow erotica. Where are you getting this? I need five co- You can also spend your night in the barnyard, where shit gets wild. Hey! They've got cow's milk on tap! That seems somewhat illegal. No way. Is that the Grimmer's shake? No drink. Oh! After celebrating Grimace's birthday, and no, I'm not sponsored by McDonald's, you make your way down to the bottom floor of the barnyard where shit gets real and our first minigame actually happens with Duke, my Narch Animus. Ne ne nemus Nemekin. Ne no, no, no! Bet you didn't come here to lose. Lightning doesn't strike twice, right? <laughs> right? I'm just gonna have to smash it. Hope for the best. Yes! No! No! I was interested to see how long this game takes to beat, and it's nine hours long. That's the entire Lord of the Rings trilogy. Tease the Mailman was also another iconic minigame. I started my first teasing session, and I was already flapping like a disabled duck. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> have I told you why they call me the Barnyard Veteran? Well, you see I don't have a key for this gate right here. Well, guess what? I can simply just climb up. I can climb up, up. This this took me quite a while, honestly, a very long time. I've been lying to you this whole time. It's the bike. We gotta use the bike. <gasps> ah, bike racing. Another classic mini game where my child brain would go nuts any time I'd hit first place. You think I'm done talking about mini games? No, no, no. I'm just getting started. A mini game where you're against the clock and picking up chicks to throw across the barnyard. A highly competitive game with a little milk squirting on the side. It's all fun and games when in the barnyard. I won, but at what cost? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, and there's gopher golf. Barnyard was terrible. It was absolutely garbage. Is what someone would say with bad taste in movies. In all seriousness, this game was a staple of my childhood and probably many others too. I'll repeat myself in saying Barnyard holds a special place in my heart and it's also safe to say Barnyard holds up as a true movie video game. It serves as a reminder of a time where animated films were quirky as hell and the video game adaptions that came with it. I had promised myself that once I hit 20,000 subscribers, I would dedicate a video to a game like Barnyard. It's safe to say that I've done just that, even if I did sexualize it. <laughs> if you'd like to see more videos like this, especially me playing movie tie-in video games, let me know down in the comments below. And as always, this is Official Blue Ben, signing off. I remember when I used to sit out here with your sister. I don't have a sister. Oh yeah.